Okay, I hope this doesn't fall. And by the way, can we just appreciate this freaking angle? Like, look how sick that is. Please give it a thumbs up. Sorry, I just came out of class. Simon, you were taking him to friends? What the hell, Simon? <laughs> That's weird. <laughs> Holy shit! You should do an eating challenge. Oh, yeah, you oh. should. Matt Stoney. Yeah, I know. I saw that too. Welcome to a brand new video. My name is Conan and as you just saw I just finished my day So I'm clean I'm showered and I'm ready to head to bed and now when I wake up tomorrow I'm gonna show you guys my entire morning routine So if you're interested in knowing what I do definitely stick around watch the entire video and now without any further ado Let's go to sleep By the way, I don't know if this is the same with you guys, but whenever I come out of the shower my skin gets really really red I don't know what it is, but um, yeah, I hope it's not just me guys before I go to sleep You're probably wondering what's this thing on my head? That's a good question. What is it? This is actually a face mask or a sleeping mask, and it's really helped me to actually sleep better. So if you're struggling sleeping, definitely would recommend one of these sleeping masks. And also because I live with a roommate, he sometimes tends to leave the light on in the kitchen. So this just really makes me focus on just sleeping, and it's really, really helpful. So A few moments later. Okay, now I know what you're thinking. You're probably expecting me to hop in here and take a cold shower, but I'm gonna keep it real with you guys and I don't really do that. All right guys, so first thing I do in the morning is I drink a big glass of water. It helps me wake up a bit more and it helps me rehydrate because obviously when you sleep, you don't drink. So uh, yeah, I'm gonna finish drinking this and I'm gonna go study. Okay guys, so why do I wake up this early? And now that's a good question. So this past couple of weeks, I've kind of, I haven't really felt lazy, just I've kind of been, it's hard to explain. I feel like I can get a lot more done in a day if I wake up earlier. So I've made the decision to start waking up a bit earlier. So I woke up at 5.30ish this morning. And I feel like you're a lot more energized in the mornings. And I feel like I can get a lot more done in the morning time compared to at night. So often what you'll find is that if you're a late night worker, you get really tired really easily. However, if you're a morning worker, you're super energized it's the first thing you do in the day, so what I like to do is I like to wake up early, get the hardest tasks I need to do done early in the morning, just so they're done, out of the way. And it kind of sets my day up for success because knowing that I had a good morning, knowing that I have a good morning routine, sets me up for having a good day later on. So if your morning is on point, your afternoon and your nights will likely follow. So I highly encourage you guys to find a morning routine as well. Do whatever works for you. Not everyone is gonna like waking up super early and getting all the work done. Just find what works for you. I've kind of been forcing myself to do this, but honestly, after a while, I'm kind of getting adjusted to this routine, so it feels really, really good. So essentially what I'm gonna be doing now is I'm gonna just get a bunch of homework done. I'm gonna study a lot because I realized last week that I have three midterms this week. So I already finished two of them. And I got one more today. Yeah, I feel really concentrated in the morning time because there's absolutely no distractions. No one's up this early, so no one's gonna be texting me. No one's gonna interrupt me. It's just me, myself, and I. This is my alone time. I get to focus, I get to study. So yeah, we're gonna be studying now for about an hour or two, and then we're gonna eat some breakfast. So essentially in the morning time, you have the most energy. And now with that energy, you gotta make sure you use that energy wisely on the hardest tasks you have for the day. So for me, that's probably studying and doing homework. So put all my energy and focus into doing that in the morning time. It's gonna set myself up for having a good day. Now, why I didn't take a cold shower or meditate or do any of those 
weird, fancy things you see morning people do with morning routines is because, okay, honestly guys, it is winter here right now, and I just, why would I take a cold shower and then go outside in the cold? Like, I'm gonna be cold all day. Like, it doesn't really make sense. I mean, I get it when it's summertime, yeah, and I get it how it like wakes up your body and it's like, really hard for you to do and it's like discipline and it's courage all that stuff but like, I don't do that like I probably should do that sometime but I'm just kind of easing my way into this whole morning routine like I mean it's good enough me waking up at like 5 30 a.m like that's hard enough for me so I'm not gonna be going all out doing all these morning routine things I'm gonna take baby steps step by step first thing, I'm gonna wake up early then I might meditate a bit more then I'm gonna take colder showers and then just it's it's a work in progress guys so I'm just happy with the routine I have right now. And this is just 100% accurate. I'm not faking anything. This is just me in the morning doing stuff. Yeah, no faking. Okay guys, I just studied for about two hours. Now I'm gonna go back into my room and eat some breakfast. Another part of my morning routine is to eat a healthy breakfast. Now, as you can see, I just got some eggs and some cream of wheat. However, it is really important to break your fast in a good and healthy way because if you start your day off eating bad greasy food, the likelihood of you eating more bad and greasy food is very likely. As opposed to if you were to eat a healthy breakfast, it kind of sets up your day to continue eating healthy throughout the day. So definitely breakfast is indeed the most important meal of the day because it really sets the tone. If you eat a healthy breakfast, I mean, like you just feel healthy throughout the day. So yeah, we've got the breakfast right here. And now while I eat this breakfast, I really like to listen to a podcast by Gary V. And like, I've been listening to this guy for probably a couple months now. And I just like learning from him. He's a really cool guy. So I'm going to eat this, listen to his podcast. And then I got to go to class pretty soon now. And I've got to write our midterm. So um, yeah, wish me luck. They either put things on a pedestal or demonize it. Like. I don't understand why people can't just understand it's a self-awareness game. Like, I don't want to be a starving artist, but somebody who loves the fuck out of it, I'm like, that's awesome. Okay, so I'm at school right now, and I got about an hour until my midterm, so I'm just gonna study for another hour, and then hopefully we'll do good on the midterm. And then I'm gonna go work out, so yeah. Okay, so I just finished my midterm, and I'm in the gym right now, just getting warmed up on the Surmaster for about five to 10 minutes. Then we're gonna crush a push workout. All right guys, so I just finished my workout, and as you saw, my morning doesn't really consist of much physical work, but rather more mental work in terms of having to study and do work on like, for school and stuff. So yeah, I'm not really big into working out in the morning because I mean, I've done it a couple of times where I've woken up and immediately go to the gym fasted. And although, I mean, just, I don't know, just, I don't, like, uh, like they're not bad, just I don't really feel 100% at my best. I'd rather have a couple of meals in me before I go to the gym to feel 100% on my game. It's a bit slippery here. My mornings consist of, well, it's just studying and work and then I go to school and then after school I like to go to the gym and work out that's just what I like to do and I mean obviously there's a lot of morning people that actually like to work out first thing in the morning and that's completely fine I don't care what you do whatever works for you honestly just I don't really because I feel like if you're forcing yourself to go in the morning try not to like go through the motions and just show up just because it's super early to show everyone you're grinding like that's not the point the whole point of going to the gym is to improve and get better and actually feel 100% so yeah if you feel 100% in the mornings go in the mornings but if you feel a bit better later on in the afternoon then go in the afternoon all right guys so as the video is coming to a close there's one more thing i want to say so guys the whole point of this whole morning routine thing is to not just have a good morning but actually to have a good rest of your day so if you start your morning well, you're setting yourself up to have a successful rest of your day. And that's basically it. Like if you have a good morning routine, but then just slack off during the day, there's no point of having a good morning routine. It's all about what you, what you do after the morning routine. That's what makes the morning routine a good habit to have because I mean, it's a great start to the day. And if you continue that pattern, 
then your day will only get better. So yeah, if you start the day right, most likely the rest of your day will be a lot better. So yeah, just keep that in mind. Just because you do something good in the morning doesn't mean that you're gonna do good. You gotta actually keep that momentum of keep doing things that are gonna help you be successful. And lastly guys, regardless of if you have a morning routine or not, the most important thing is to get at least seven to nine hours of sleep. If you don't get enough sleep in a day, then most likely the next day you'll probably feel super tired and not have enough energy. So regardless of what you do, make sure you get your sleep in. All right, and with that said, guys, I'm gonna end the video right here. So I sincerely hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope you guys learned something, and kind of understand how important it is to start your day off right because it can have a major impact on the rest of your day. So I sincerely hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, can you please give this video a thumbs up? It will mean the world to me. Subscribe to my channel if you are new and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.